Say it. Hello, not hello. Okay. So tell me, what are you doing today, Molly? Um, I'm selling stuff like um books, things, and I'll, I'll I it's in my backpack, and I'll get out. Just pretend I'm the customer, okay? Okay. You come and knock on the door. I'll go inside, and then you knock on the door, and then I'll pretend I'm the person, and you're selling me one, okay? Hello. Hi. Hi. My name is Molly, and I have some um stuff of reading stuff, and you can buy them, and um and if you want to, you can have you can have them for a little. You can have them. Uh, how much? Um, I don't know. Maybe about ten or four dollars. How much? Ten or four dollars. Well, that's a lot of money. How much could it be? I don't know. Well, you got to know how much it is. I'll be right back. Okay. You have one dollar. Can that picture is one dollar? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> like that? Like that. Okay. But you got to tell me what kind of pictures are you going to do for me? You haven't told me yet. Okay, so now we know it's one dollar. What are you selling to me? When you go to that house and knock on the door, what are they going to give you a dollar for? For the stories. When are you going? And then if they order stories, then what? You do the stories on Saturday, and then you take give them the stories, mm -hmm. and when you give them the stories, then they'll give you the money. Oh, yeah. They, you don't. Yeah, you don't want to get the money now. Because you you have to do the stories first. But I don't have all those. Stories. You're just taking an order. I don't have all of those stories. But... Well, you got to make sure that you can give them stories. I was only going to come over here just to see Grandma and Grandpa okay. for a little bit. Hey, you got, he's going to sit down here and talk to Grandpa. Sit down here. Mom and I made some chili. We want some? Fresh tomatoes. Here. Yeah, I suppose I could have a, I could have a little chili. Here's the bowl. Here's the scoop. And stick it to the bottom where you kind of squirrel it up or whatever. We had tomatoes here. Oh, dang it, we got a lot up there yet. Told Mom, I said, I got it. Ooh, it looks pretty good. Chili. You want anything to drink? Like milk? Nope. nope. To me, uh, chili made with fresh tomatoes is tomatoes. Well, it's pretty hot. Mmm. Good. <clears throat> so, we had a pretty big hood. Let's simmer down a little bit to thicken up a little more. Mom's ideas. Okay. Molly is bound and determined to go sell stuff door to door. I says, well, how much? She says, well, four or ten dollars. You know, I says, well, <laughs> four or ten dollars. So I'm going to let her go and do it, but i got to stay kind of just behind her. Yeah. I'll let her do what she wants, <clears throat> in a way. What's she trying to tell? Stories. You mean like she's giving grandma now? Just tell them a story or something? No. 
she'll make them up and draw them out and, <laughs> and she'll bring them over on Saturday. That's kind of like Not me. Nope. You think I'm crazy or what? <laughs> I just told Mom a little while ago. I talked to Dave for almost an hour last night. <clears throat> From 9.30 to quarter to 10. I don't know. About 10 After 10, yeah. Or, I don't know. I told him that you were thinking about getting a 57 Buick. Yeah, I, I got a fax from him or whatever, did you? Email or what? Email. It? It's not called electronic mail. Email. Oh. <clears throat> How do you do that? You turn on your computer. Well, you got to have a computer. Yep. <clears throat> Type in his address, get on the telephone lines on the internet and hit send. It doesn't cost anything. How can they do that for now? No, it's not actually nothing. It's nothing for me, but I don't know most people probably have to spend about 10 bucks a month to have a service. Mm -hmm. And you can email all you want. You mm -hmm. could be emailing all the time for 10 bucks a month. It seems to me there was something else I was going to ask you about. I'm kind of connected with that or whatever it was that I sure don't understand. But I don't know what it was, though. <laughs> So, okay. Boy, did I ever get a nice picture of a 57 Buick Roadmaster off the internet. Well, that's the one you were telling me, wasn't it? The one up in Hibbing or something? Mm -hmm. That guy linked me back, and here's what he said. I, brought, I printed it off. I thought, I don't have time to read it now, but... If you can read it, it's pretty small type, but... Read it out loud, I don't know what it says. Jason or something. Start right down there. This is basically subject and stuff. Subject. And then this was the second one that he sent me. I just glanced at it. Oh, anyhow, I am not very good at reading Jim. Front end is fine. Both steering and looks is it's a Roadmaster 74. Five. Yeah, I asked him what it was, if it was a special or a super. I guess the Roadmaster is the top of the line that year. Well, I guess so. the top way here. Uh, the top of the line, and the 75 means it was uh, decked out style. Needs some exhaust work. I think just needs muffler and maybe some new pipe. I went through St. Joe today, then to St. Cloud. I'm in Morris, and that's most Morris. I gotta get the line now. In Morris, and that's where I bought the car. Drove it from Morris to Ely six hours. Brakes are mostly all new and works good. My dad's first car to drive was a '56 Super. <clears throat> that's why we bought it. But I need college bucks and don't have the time alone to do it. I mailed all the pictures I had out to. Others. If I had any, they'd be a meeting. And I can't have my mom starting to look through my pictures, you know. <laughs> wow, yeah, I'm looking through his pictures. Yeah, I might find some dirty ones. What? Wow, that would suck. Uh, I gotta get my eyes open. <laughs> I will have Dad try and borrow someone's cooler ride, maybe a few days. Really would be about four and a half hours, a five hour drive to you. That's nothing. Give me a call some night, whatever it is, if you have any other questions. If I'm not, I'll uh, be the missus. Thank you, Jason. And then over here, he has four leaks and has one. Oh, my friend. Oh, four leaks and has one here, power steering, and Dad and I couldn't find it. It doesn't affect the steering. said there's some rust on the rocker panels and of course where the 
tailpipes come out, they're all rusted out pretty oh, much. They come out through the bumper. Yeah, yeah. that yeah. bumper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bad design. Yes, that was because it burned the bumper. Yeah. The tailpipe looked rusted. good. Looked good though, didn't it? <clears throat> I told Debbie last night, I said, you know, I can just see buying that thing. You and I driving up there, I'm halfway home and I have to tow it back home. Oh, jeez, wouldn't that be horrible? Well, then in a way, I can use my AAA. <laughs> yeah. That's the other 15 minutes, and then I'm going to turn this off. This picture of this black, I got a black Buick Roadmaster that I got off the internet. This guy wants to sell it for his for 8900 bucks. And when you look at the picture, you go, that is sharp. That is one sharp car, that 57 Buick. Yes, Mr. Right He also said it had a cracked windshield, but all the other glass was okay. And this, this one here, but I, you know, maybe the mine them. Well, for beauty, I don't know. I don't know. It's two thousand dollars and probably about four to really go through putting the hoses on and mm -hmm. you know all the gaskets mm -hmm. and and then who knows about the body? I mean, and a body and a paint job. I go, oh, man, oh my man, I I figured it out. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> you know. I'm going to get back to this here much. That 48 Chevy I worked at Fairgrounds. What the heck was the price on that? Uh, 4800 bucks. 4500 Yeah. You know, that was kind of... bucks, but that was... That body looked really sharp all the way around. And that motor really sound had that... Yeah. <laughs> just like they always had because they had yeah. mechanical lifters. But... Uh, and everything was original? Yep. You know, you could probably put very few miles on that. You are very. You put a two thousand miles on it in the summer, oh. if that. I mean, it's just kind of a cruising car around yeah. town for thirty, forty miles on a nice night like tonight. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't be fun. So I'd say, Dad, let's go. I got that fifty six. Let's just take it out and shift it around. And you know, that's what I kind of wanted to do. I thought it'd be a hobby. Well, but if you don't, if you don't have one that's in pretty good shape, and you gotta oh. be, you gotta be messing with it. You can have a money pit. Yeah, you know, that 57 Buick would be a money pit. You get a 57 Buick would be a money pit. To me, yeah. rel relative to a 55 or 56 straight six yeah. Chevy or something like that. Yeah, and that Buick has to be eight. Like, no, a 55, 56 Chevy six. Uh, some of the minor work, I would mind, I could do it, too. some of it. But get into V8, forget it, I ain't part of it. I didn't want to even take a battery. I had a hard time yesterday taking that battery out of Debbie's car. I had to call somebody out to do it. Okay. <laughs> Just a screw. Scott Scherfenberg says, he says, you know, if you're not prepared to do any of this, why? I mean, you, you got to be, to a point. Yeah, but still, you're on the computers, and I could give a shit less. We each have our own thing. Yeah. If you want more chili, it's... Oh, I'm, I'm fine. Plenty there. That was really tasty. I gotta start. Well, I'm gonna let it simmer till six. Mom said to do that. Uh, I gotta take, I'm turn it off. Debbie wants me to get Molly to um, choir tonight at six thirty, so I gotta get her probably out of here in about five or ten minutes to our house and then drive her to choir. Where's that at? Bethlehem Lutheran Church. Oh my! So I gotta, and she really is against it. Well, I said, and that doesn't help. Really. Yeah, no, I won't take her. <laughs> <clears throat> but I gotta just make sure she's thinking about it. Molly, we have to get ready to go to choir. No, I'm going to deliver more. You know that. I know. You can go one more place tonight, and then we gotta go to choir. One more place? Yeah. Okay. How much is it? How much are you charging for your stories and pictures? Um, it has to be done before, three pennies before for I uh, three pennies. Oh yeah, I told her that she has to. She takes orders tonight, yeah. and then she has to do the project, yeah. and then she can deliver it. And when she delivers it, that's when she gets that's paid. That's when she gets paid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Three pennies. What the the three pennies is not enough. Three pennies for Graham because she doesn't have very much dollars, and then after it, like Emma and Hannah's house. Well, what she's going to do is um, trace one of these pictures in here and, and How could I trace color it? Color it for her. 
with a pencil. Stay on the lines. That would, I don't know what you had in mind, but. Well, we need to help Molly because she went out and I asked her how much she was going to charge because that's important to know. She said four or ten dollars. I said, well, you know, that's not right because nobody's going to spend that much. And so we wanted to come up with at least how much it was. And then we had to make sure she understood that she wouldn't take the money today, but she'll take orders and get their names and then do the project, bring it back, and then they'll give her the money. And you can do that tonight if you want. But we have we should really go to choir because you know why? Mm. Oh yeah, you should go to choir. I don't want. It'd be fun. Have you been to choir this year? Nope, this would be your first night. Oh. Okay. Ooh, you might be in for surprise how nice it is. Then. Lots of fun. We do have to leave in ten minutes, though, Molly, to go to choir. So, in about five minutes, I'll let you know, and then then we gotta go. You're copying way too much of it, I think. I think if you just copied the, the, the deer, just the deer, not this other stuff. Kind of nice, you can run over to Grandma. Should I go now? Yeah, you go now, and I'll, I'll do it for you. Okay. Then, you, then you can cover it. You're going to have a good choir effect. Yeah. At least go tonight and see, you okay. might really like it. It might be really fun, I think it would be. Yep. I have to go back to my, one of my friend's house, okay? What's that other pen there? Is that yours or somebody else? And what friend's house are you going to bike to? That's What? What other friend's house are you going to go bike to? I'm in Hannah and Erica. Because Erica and Brian live together because they're brother and sister. Then I'm and Hannah live together because they're sisters. So. How about we get ready and go to choir? You, you want to have uh, some bananas to eat or something? I wanted her to have some bully. Jim, the bowl of it. You thought you did a good job? I mm -hmm. think I How about your shoes? Where are you going, Molly? She was so bent. There's your shoes here, Molly. I don't think they're grandma's. You got both the same size today? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Molly, you go to just Emma and Hannah's, and then you come home. You're not going to let her go by herself. Yeah, she's going by herself. Okay. Where's Emma and Hannah live at? Okay, Emma. They live down on the end of, uh, right at the yeah. corner of um, Ironwood. So we can st yeah, we can stand out on your driveway and I can watch her, and then I'm gonna. He's, he's, he's following her. Keep an eye on him. On her. I was thinking it was way over on the other side. Oh, she's got her bike. I saw yeah. her. She's hot. She's hot. She is bent on selling and making, all, getting money. Yeah. She wants to get money. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. Well, I better stare at the cheerleading. Yeah. Can she make it down the driveway now? I, I she knows how to break. She doesn't want to break. She wants to do it this way. Now that's the wrong way. No, she's got her, pretty, <laughs> she got her feet out. Not anymore. She had them on her front first. She doesn't understand that braking can be slow braking. The only braking she knows is it's you skid or yeah. you use your feet. <laughs> she, is, she is really funny. She is. Yeah. Sure, changing a lot. Oh, it's changing.